everyone and welcome to a 15 minute total body dumbbell workout with me, Sarah from London Mums Fitness, LDN Mums Fitness. You can find all my de details here. So I am a pre and postnatal exercise specialist. We are holistic wellness solution encouraging all women to prioritise their health and move their body with confidence. So I'm super excited to be taking over the Hot Milk Lingerie um, page today. I'm actually wearing their leggings. These are their new um, super comfy um, athletic range. Really, really comfy. Really nice soft cotton um, band for the bump. And you've got pockets both sides. Absolutely lovely. So I am 29 weeks pregnant right now and just love exercising with them. And they're squat proof, which is really exciting. So back to this workout. So yes, encouraging all women, prenatal, postnatal, all women to exercise with confidence throughout their pregnancy. So you can find all our details over on Mountain Mums Fitness, but we're gonna do a really good 15 minute total body dumbbell workout. So if you haven't any dumbbells, no worries at all. Grab yourself water bottles or any sort of like resistance, weight, tins, anything's absolutely fine. You can still do this if you haven't got any equipment as well. I have got some weights with me here today. So we're going to be going through each one. We've got um, 15 completely different exercises, so we're going to be really challenging that body. 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. We're going to nice warm up at the start. Always prepare that body, getting ready for exercise, and then cool down at the end to bring that body back to its pre-exercise state. So if you've got any questions at all um, at the end, then do drop me a message, come say hello. And otherwise, Let's get started. Make sure you've got some water to hand. There's going to be no official water breaks, so do grab a drink as and when you need to. And if you need to rest any time, then please do. And this is going to be saved onto the Hot Milk Lingerie's um, IGTV page at the end, so you can give it a go. As you can see, the weather is lovely here in the sun. They're based in New Zealand, which is so exciting. Never been, would love to go. Um, but let's get going. So we've got a one minute warm up to start with, and then we'll get started. So I'm going to start by jogging the spot. There's always going to be modifications. So either jogging or marching on the spot, whichever you find easier, keeping those shoulders nice and relaxed, so tummy in tight, rolling those shoulders back, big circles, breathing through everything, and taking it forward. So always listening to your body. Okay, I'll be talking throughout the whole of this workout, taking that body side to side to ease out that lower back, getting it ready for exercise, reaching over, nice big stretch and cross. Fantastic. And just opening up those hips with nice simple body weight squats. Take it nice and slow, inhaling down, exhaling as we're coming up. Shaking it off, rounding the back, and opening it out really good. Getting ready for our first exercise, which is really nice and easy, jogging on the spot. Are we ready? Let's go. 40 seconds. So keeping that tummy in nice and tight, relaxing those shoulders, nice tall posture. Okay, breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. Remember, rest at any time if you need to. Okay, squeezing that pelvic floor, really good way to test the pelvic floor it is here. Absolutely fantastic, keep it going. Over halfway now, 15 seconds to go, keep it going. Nice soft dance, nice tall posture, taking it through or marching, whichever you find easier. Listening to your body is so important. And resting it there, fantastic. Right, let's grab these weights. Taking your weight, okay? Holding the weights up to your shoulders. So important in all of these rests that you really stop, ready for the next exercise. We're inhaling down, exhaling, thrusting to come up. Are we ready? And let's go, inhale down, exhale, thrust to come up. So weight in the heels. So you can definitely see that these leggings are squat proof. Exhale, coming up, you haven't got to pull them up or anything, it's so good. So many leggings I've tried, where you've got to pull them up, the band falls down, not these ones, super comfy. Inhale, exhale, thrust up. Really good, get it down nice and low, weight in the heels. As you go down, you should be able to lift your toes up. Thrusting, squeezing the glutes at the top. Pulling up on that pelvic floor. Inhale. Exhale up. And rest it there. Fantastic. Placing the weights down. When you come down to the floor, you just press up, okay? 
So either on the knees or off the knees, completely up to you. I can go on the knees, being 29 weeks pregnant, modifying, arms out wide, knees together, legs not crossed, inhaling down, exhaling, coming up, squeezing those glutes. Using that breath, elbows come out to the side, exhale, push up, really nice, inhale, exhale, push up, fantastic, and again. Using that breath, squeezing the glutes, hips pointing down to the floor, Exhale, push up, fantastic. Really good, nice and strong. Just think strength, think power. Exhale, push up. Awesome work, doing good. Everyone give me one more. And resting there, fantastic. Coming up to standing. Right, let's do one of my favourites, skipping. Invisible skipping, hands come out to the side. Relax those shoulders. Roll the shoulders up, back and down. Squeezing the glutes tight. Are we ready? Really good to test that pelvic floor. Have you been doing your pelvic floor exercises? Let's go. So either jumping like so, or marching, or jogging on the spot. Completely up to you. Keeping that tummy nice and tight. Pelvic floor exercises, really important to do, whether you're pregnant, postpartum or not. Naturally, as we get older, that pelvic floor will weaken. It's just one of those things. So it's always really important to strengthen it. And this is a great way of testing it. I can certainly feel it. 29 weeks pregnant, still going strong. But I'm mindful of it. Two. Oh, rest it there, fantastic. How are you feeling? Don't forget, grab a drink of water if you need. Because there's no official water breaks, okay? So. Grabbing those weights, taking it, and we're going to bicep curls. So feet hip width apart, roll the shoulders up, back and down, palms out, inhale up, exhale down, and exhale down, perfect, and again. Inhale up, exhale down, perfect. Take it nice and slow, so not swinging, we want that time under tension. Really good, squeezing the glutes, soft knees, Pulling up on that pelvic floor, and I say pulling up on your pelvic floor, as if you're holding in from letting wind pass. Okay, or holding in the blueberry, lots of different ways you can think about it. Inhale, and exhale down. And again, inhale, exhale down. One more. And resting it there, fantastic, placing those weights down. Are we ready? Knee drives, another one of my favourite cardio moves. So, 40 seconds on one side, 20 seconds off, and 40 seconds on the other. So, nice, long, we're going to drive the leg in and out. Are we ready? Let's go. So this is not crunching team. We're just doing these knee drives, driving that knee in, taking the arms down. When the arms come up over the head, you're getting that heart rate to come up that little bit higher. Because the blood is going to travel that a little bit further. Now notice, I'm pregnant, 29 weeks. I'm still talking through all of these workouts, so I'm maintaining a conversation, knowing that my heart rate's not going to be getting too high. Okay? If you need to rest any time, please do. And just jump back in when you're ready. And resting it there. Fantastic. What you do on one side, it's got to be done on the other. So, coming over to the other side, making sure there's nothing in the way and getting ready to do the other side. Are we ready? In seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and let's go, drive it in. Keeping things nice and even, what you do on one side, you do on the other. Leaning forward slightly, full extension, driving it in. Okay, you can take it slowly, okay, or pick it up, pick up that pace. Breathing through it. Exhale as you drive that knee in and the arms come down to the side. Coming up to 10 seconds to go, team. Doing good. Just think it's just 15 minutes and then you are done for the day. Really nice. Nice and strong. Fabulous. How are we feeling? Feeling good? Right, let's pick up these weights. 
total body dumbbell, roll the shoulders up, back and down, deadlifts. So soft knees, hip width apart. We inhaling down, keeping the weights nice and close to the legs, using the glutes, thrusting to come up. Let's go, inhale, exhale, thrusting as we come up, inhale, feet and hamstrings, coming up to so a from the hips, exhale, thrust to come up, really nice. Coming up to halfway, inhale down, thrust, exhale, coming up, fantastic. Keep it going, keep it strong, keeping that straight back, eyes looking forward. And exhale. Everyone give me one more. Inhale. Take it nice and slow. And rest it there, placing one weight down on the floor. Or you can hold both, it's completely up to you. Most important thing when we're doing all these exercises is technique. Technique is your number one. So important to get that technique right and not just like repping out as many as you can. Technique is so key to reduce injury and injury and maximise results. Trust for extension. Elbows pointing forward. Okay, so elbows aren't tap wide. Soft knees, tummy tight, inhale. Exhale, coming up. So we've got our on-demand platform on on-demand fitness. Really nice, manageable 6 to 20 minute workouts throughout the platform. Over 500 videos there now. For all women, all fitness levels, pregnancy and postpartum safe. We've got our monthly challenges on there as well. 12 minutes long, such results we're getting, it's super exciting. Inhale, exhale, coming up. Fantastic, doing good. Right, let's get down to the floor. Let's do a blue bridge. So weight to the side, coming down. Knee bent, lying on your back. Knees hip width apart. You're inhaling, thrusting the hips up. Exhaling, coming down. Okay, ready? And let's go. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale, squeeze, exhale down. A really interesting fact here that glute bridges, anything upside down really helps to get baby in that right position, weirdly enough. So if, if you got, have got a, um, a breech baby, get into that glute bridge. If you've got any other questions about breech babies, please do drop me a message over on London Mums Fitness. Inhale up. Exhale down, push the hips to the sky, squeeze the glutes, the core of the pelvic floor, nice and slow. Everyone give me one more, inhale. And exhale down, fantastic, coming, gently coming up to standing. We're gonna come to some split squats here. So taking the weights, one in each hand, roll the shoulders up, back and down, one foot forward, one foot back. Okay, we're doing split squats, it's fine that our front knee goes over the toe. Are we ready? 40 seconds on one side. Let's go. Inhale down. Exhale, push up. Fantastic. We're well over halfway. Inhale, exhale, push up. Three exercises after this and you are done. Doing so well. This will be saved so you can repeat it as many times as you like. And do tag us in your post-workout selfies because I love to be a part of your journey. See how you're getting on with or without bump. Exhale, push up. Inhale, exhale, push. Really good, last few seconds. And we're going to be two more. And one more. And shake it off, fantastic. What you're doing on one side. Let's take it over to the other side. One foot forward, one foot back. Remember, grab a drink when you need. No official water breaks in this. So important to hydrate that body and fuel the body right afterwards with really colorful nutrition. Two, one, let's go. Exhale, push up. Awesome work, team. Exhale, push. Exhale, push up nice and strong. Really good, straight back, looking forward. Really good, over halfway now. Keep it going. Feeling it in the quads mainly with these split squats and in the glutes as well. Squeeze the glutes, that extra little bit at the top. One more. And shake it off, fantastic work. Right, let's get these shoulders working, team. Shoulder press. 
arms up, okay? Shoulder height 90-90, not below, not higher, soft knees, tummy tight, inhale up and exhale down. Are we ready? Inhale and exhale. Now if it's too much with the two, alternate, okay? But the more you squeeze the glutes, the more you squeeze that core, the more you use your breath to help you, the easier it will be on the arms. If you need to drop the weights at any time, please do place them down safely. And if you want to give yourself a little bit of a push towards the end, that always helps. Exhale, push up really good. Inhale. Squeeze and press, fantastic, keeping it on, keep it strong. And resting it there, fantastic, place those weights down. Let's do some star jumps. Test that pelvic floor once again. Okay, so you can either jump it out or step it out. Just take those arms up over the head, keeping the shoulders relaxed. Be mindful of that pelvic floor always. Ready? Let's go. 40 seconds. Inhale and exhale, taking control of that breath, listening to your body. Baby does not love a good jump around. Definitely being mindful of that pelvic floor right now. And once again, when you're doing these jumps, not worrying about that band falling down. Quality sports settings here. Coming up to 10 seconds to go, team. And we've got one more exercise and we're done. In three, two, rest. Fantastic work. Right, one of my favourites to finish with, squat and press. One weight. Squatting down, forward press in front of you. A full compound movement using legs, arms and cardiovascular system. Roll the shoulders, squat, forward press. Thrusting the hips to the top. Really nice. And once we finish this exercise, do not go anywhere. We've got to take that body back to its pre exercise state. Cooling down, super key. Inhale, exhale forward. Right to the end. 10 seconds, and you are done. Really nice thrusting at the top. Slow and controlled. rest. You are done. Fantastic. How are you feeling? March on the spot, gradually taking that heart rate down. Amazing. We made it team. Reaching over and the other side. One more. Thank you so much everyone for joining me today. Nice big deep squat, reaching up and take to the other side. Fantastic, and gently rolling up, staying down, feeling nice, stretch down those hamstrings. Gently coming up to standing, roll the shoulders, in top the fingers up, ignore the time now. In top the fingers behind, never rush, cooling down and stretching, keeping the hands together. Really good work. And shake it off, I love to finish all my classes. With a nice big deep breath, so give me two breaths, ready? And exhale. And again. And one more fill up, let's go for it. And exhale, and give yourselves all a huge round of applause. That was absolutely incredible. So like you, but I feel so energized right now. I feel so good. Honestly, the endorphins, they're out. Cortisol levels, their stress um, hormones, they're down. Just feeling so much better. So come and say hello to me over on London Mums Fitness. Thank you so much to Hot Milk Lingerie for letting me do a takeover today. Really, really enjoyed it. Let me know if you thought of it. Tag to and post workout selfies as well. As I said, I will be saving this onto their IGTV. Pregnant, 29 weeks, still moving. It's all about taking control, listening to your body. If you've got any questions at all, please head over and ask me anything. I've got online personal training with myself, 
we've got our on-demand platform, we've got our pregnancy and postpartum home workout guides, nutrition coaching, you name it. Remember, London Mums Fitness is your holistic wellness solution to encourage women, all women, to prioritise their health. Thank you so much. And I'll see you over on London Mums Fitness soon and hopefully we'll be doing more with um, Hotman Lingerie in the near future. Have a fantastic day and see you soon.